I was on a street store one day asking people to buy shares and a lady came up to me and she said, I'm on a pension, I've got $100 spare here at the moment, can I buy shares? I said, but what about your food, etc." She said, I just got this thing, I just think this community bank's such a great idea. So St Helens is essentially a tourist town in the northeast of Tasmania. Population about two and a half thousand. People mostly come here for the lifestyle. You know, it's the best beaches you'll ever get in the world, not just Australia. The clean green image of Tassie is still well and truly alive. What I love about St Helens is the community feel about it. You can go down the street, have a conversation with someone. It's really lovely. St Helens itself is a very buoyant community now. We've got a lot of investment coming in and the need for a bank in our community is uh, absolutely paramount. We'd seen what's happened with the other community banks, putting money back in, helping local businesses, helping local organisations, making it more viable, making it a better place to live. The Benio Bank Community Bank model is based around a sharing model and it's up to the board of directors for each community bank to determine where their funds need to be spent. Is it aged care, is it youth education, is it not-for-profit groups, sporting groups, so that then hopefully every community that we're represented in has got a sustainable model going forward. I thought there'd be 10 people here today. This is tremendous. <laughs> As you'll appreciate, this has been a bit of a journey. Um, we're nearly seven years in from our first meeting. We've had plenty of good times, we've had some difficult times, we've even had a couple of sad times through this process, but we've stuck with it and we're here today. So welcome along everyone, this is just absolutely fantastic. Local communities can sometimes get left behind. This community bank will help that community have its own decision making power. I think it gives us a bit of ownership of our own bank. Little towns need something to grab hold of and call their own. A lot of people have worked really hard to get it up off the ground and now it's up to us to support it. I think it actually puts some confidence back into the business community. We're going to have a branch, we're going to have one that's open. Every little town needs backing and this might be our little avenue to succeeding, our kids succeeding and I suppose as you get older that's what it's all about. Without further ado, we'd like to say Medigo Bank is now open for business. You see the community of St Helens, it's just a normal community who have banded together to build what is now a sustainable model. And this is a model that can be rolled out across Australia to similar communities like St Helens and St Mary's.